I love this turbo to the max the quality is strong it spools up at 2.5 to 3.0 revolutions per minute my only thing is I wish it would come with a manual telling what is the recommended restrictor size for the oil feed because this is my first turbocharger installation. Wanted to use the turbo for a little bit before writing a review overall the turbo is doing great. No bearing play lateral or vertical although I'm not pushing the turbo hard it's only seen 8c waste gate pressure so far installed on a H23 a prelude the picks are for the 0.48 trim turbo. I couldn't find actually dimensions for outlet so I thought I would post them for everybody one thing to know with this turbo is it didn't have the waste gate vacuum line on the compressor side. At least mine didn't have one. So you might have to drill and tap for one but for the money you can't beat it and really it was to test fit and light tune till I upgraded to a better turbo. Fits a D-series pretty good and it's AC compatible. Haven't tried the turbo on. But first impression looks great quality for the price. It is balanced. Well I haven't put the turbo on yet but I did inspect it and it seems well built. It'll know more when I put it on next month. I purchased two of these for a budget build. After about 100 miles one both. One is still trucking along while the other started pissing oil out of the compressor housing. They are cheap turbos. Buyer beware. It's a roll of the dice.